Hello there, welcome to Blink and Beep. Thanks a lot for choosing to watch this video. In this video, we will find out about how to add scenes to your Tingsi smart device. So, what is a scene? Scene is basically an uh, action that will be performed automatically by the Tingsi device in the condition that we had set is matched. For example, let's uh, consider this living room here, which is a two node Tingsi device, and I have two devices, tube light and uh, LED bulbs configured to the two switches. Now, if I want the LED bulbs to be switched on whenever the tube light is switched on, I can simply create a scene to match this condition and uh, whenever my tube light is switched on, my LED bulbs will also get switched on. Similarly, let's say you have purchased a 16 amps Tingsy device and you have the heater connected to it and if you want to turn off the heater after 15 minutes automatically, you can create a scene for that as well. We will create a few scenes to understand the different possibilities we get with scenes. So let's get started. To create a scene, click on the plus icon on the bottom of the screen and select scene. Now this is where we create a new scene. Let's take a look at what the screen has in it. First one is the scene name where we can provide a relevant name to the scene. For example, water heater, turn off timer or uh, emergency or whatever relevant name you can think of. Next is the condition. We will have to set a condition on which this scene has to work and then the actions. So it is not action but actions. So we can have multiple actions that can be performed in one single scene. Like we can have two or more lights turned on at the same time. And finally the enable toggle. So if you want to just create the scene but don't want to put it into working right away, then you can have this toggle disabled which will disable the scene until you manually enable it. Once we do all this, we can simply click add scene button which creates a scene for us. So let's start with the timer example. I am typing the scene name as uh, tube light switch off timer. You can follow this for a water heater as well, provided you have a 16 amps Tingsy device connected to your water heater. But I don't have a water heater configured, so going with a tube light example. Now clicking on the plus icon in the if part here, we are presented with three options, tap to perform, time of day and smart device. We will see all the three one by one. Now for the first scene, I am selecting smart device. And in the new screen, I am selecting tube light under the living room. Now let's say if my tube light is switched on, then I want it to get switched off after 15 minutes. So selecting on and clicking done. So the condition is if my tube light is switched on, then what it should do. So let's add the action by clicking on the plus icon near the then part here. Let's select delay here. Now let's say for this demo purpose, uh, I choose just one minute and click on done. Now is the important step. Uh, we need to define what needs to happen after this one minute delay, which is to turn off the tube light. For this, we will have to add another action, clicking on the plus icon again. Select smart device, select the tube light under the living room. And now we have to select off and click done. So that's it. Now let's click on add scene. So our scene is created now. To view the scene, click on the icon on the bottom right. Here is our scene that we created. It is enabled as well. So going back to home screen. Now if I have the tube light turned on here and wait for one minute, it should turn off my tube light. So let's wait for it. That's it. Our tube light is switched off. Although I haven't captured the video of my tube light turning off, I can confirm it works as expected. Now what's even better is you don't have to switch on the tube light from the app all the time. But instead, you can also switch it on from the physical switch which will still trigger the timer scene and uh, turns it off after the set time interval. And you can also disable the scene without deleting it. If you decide that you don't want the scene to be performed temporarily, uh, you can also enable it at any time later without any issues. Now let's move on to creating next scene and use the second type of condition which is tap to perform, clicking on plus button and selecting scene. Let's say you are home alone and you hear a sound from outside, a tricky situation even for the bravest of us. So let's create a scene named emergency. And for the if condition, let's click on the plus icon and uh, select tap to perform. 
and for the actions since this is an emergency situation what i would like to do is turn on all the lights in my home immediately uh, with a single click in my tingc mobile app and also with the convenience of being in the same place or room without compromising our safety so clicking on the plus icon select smart device and from here we will have to add the lights one by one for the actions so you can choose the lights that you want to be turned on in an emergency situation like this in my case i will choose the living room tube light and from the pathway i will choose ceiling led and the led bulb first choosing living room tube light and selecting on and uh, clicking on done again click on the plus icon select smart device select ceiling led from pathway select on and click on done then again one more time clicking on the plus icon select smart device select led bulb from the pathway select on and click on done so if you have more lights added to your tingsi devices you can add them in the actions one by one here this is the beauty of this tingsi device it doesn't restrict you to a single tingsi device you can choose any tingsi device within a single scene so make sure the scene is in enable state and click on add scene now our emergency scene is created let's see how to make use of it we need to actually click on this power icon right next to the enable toggle but before doing that let's go to the home screen here as we see the lights that i added to my emergency scene such as the living room tube light pathway ceiling led and the led bulb are all turned off now uh, let's see if they all get powered on when i tap the emergency scene navigating to the scene screen now i'm clicking on the power icon of my emergency scene here scene activated now let's go back to the home screen there we go all our three lights are turned on all at the same time but you are still on your own to get out of the room and go check about that sound though and the third scene type is something similar to the schedule option but actually a lot more than that to say because with schedulers we have to create individual schedule to turn on and another individual schedule to turn off your smart device at a particular time of the day and one schedule will do one action for only one device i actually have a separate video made explaining about how to create and edit and delete schedulers the link should be visible on the top right corner of this video now i have also provided the link to the video in the description as well please check it out if needed so let's create the new scene now let's name this as turn on lights assuming we have few lights that we would like to turn on every day at about 6 pm in the evening we can achieve it with this scene now for the if condition clicking on the plus icon select time of the day here you can create a scene which will perform this action repeatedly every day or uh, execute just once so i choose repeat and for the days you can either leave it at all days or uh, select particular days in which you want this scene to work i select all days and click okay then the time i will select 6 pm and click done clicking on done now let's go to the actions clicking on the plus icon select smart device i want my living room lights to be switched on at 6 pm every day so selecting tube light here select on and click done again i'm going to add one more light also so clicking on plus icon again selecting smart device and under the living room i am selecting the led bulb selecting on and clicking on done now we are all set so clicking on add scene that's it our scene to turn on our living room lights every day at 6 pm is created and enabled One more additional information is that the scenes that we create will not affect us in any way from turning on or uh, turning off our smart devices from the home screen or even from the physical switches. So we are free to operate them at any time at our will. Also, you can create a similar scene to turn off the lights at a specific time as well. So we have covered a few different scenarios about how we could make use of the scenes and the possibilities to use and configure scenes. will be even more based on the type of smart devices we use at our home and it also depends on what actions we would like to perform with those devices as well i believe i was able to give you a fair idea on what scenes are and how they are useful to us catch you in another video thank you bye bye